Black Theater Festival this year, you're going to have to wait one more year. The oldest professional black theater company in the state produces this festival and just announced today the postponement due to the pandemic. Our Justin Schreer explains where the decision came from and the economic impact the festival has on this region. COVID-19 has had a significant impact on the theater community throughout the United States. And here in the Piedmont Triad, it's no different, but festival organizers say they will be back. The festival is always outstanding. These are some of the sights and sounds of previous National Black Theater Festivals held in Winston-Salem. The nearly week-long event educates and entertains people each year. But because of COVID-19, the festival was postponed. The more we looked at it, uh, we decided that it was in the best interest of patrons as well as for the company and the community to postpone it and make it bigger and better in 2022. In 2019, the festival's economic impact in the triad was huge. It was the largest in its history, generating more than $10 million. So we have more than 60,000 people that are coming into town. That's a buzz in and of itself when there are more than 30 companies that are here and over 125 performances during the course of the week. That's a lot to be amped up about. The official sales and marketing agency for the area, Visit Winston-Salem, says they are looking forward to working with staff at the North Carolina Black Repertory Company and the National Black Theater Festival as they welcome visitors back in 2022. As we say, there's a seat for you in 2022, so we're looking forward to people coming in that, at that time. In the meantime, Nigel Alston says the repertory company will offer folks ways to learn and experience theater in other ways virtually. In Winston-Salem, Justin Schreyer, WXII 12 News. Justin, thank you. The state is also updating its.